Hello everyone and welcome to English for Construction. Today we will study Unit 1, the construction industry. First, vocabulary number 1. Match the photos A to F, sorry A to E, to test from 1 to 5. Number 1. Hello, I'm Camo Bao Khalid from Morocco. I'm a plumber. Plumber here. So let the E. Number two. I'm Isabel Ruth from France. I'm an architect. Architect is here. Number C. Let the C. Next, number three. Hi, my name is Santiago Cruz. I'm from Venezuela. I'm a grand operator. We're here. Let the D. Number four. Hi, I'm Carol Nowacki. I'm from Poland. I'm a roofer. Is here. Let the B. Number five. Hello there. My name is John. Takahashi. I'm from Japan. I'm a building inspector. Here, let the A. Next, listening to. Come lead these conversations, then listen and compare your answers. Okay, we will listen. Okay, so number one, what is it? Number one, I'm Isabel Rus. I'm from France. And number three, I'm a building inspector. Number four, pleased to meet you. Number five, I'm a grand, grand what? Operator. Operator. And number six, me, I'm a ripper. Ruffer. Number seven. My name is and Camo M. Santiago. Number eight. Where are you from? Number nine. I come from. Morocco Morocco Sorry, double C
Morocco Number 10 Hello, my name Camo Bocatlet Number 11 What do you do? Number 12 She's an architect An architect Architect Okay, I will rewrite it Architect Okay, before we listen again, we read the test so that we can practice speaking Hi, I'm Jun Takahashi from the ministry Hi, Mr. Kasahashi I'm Isabella Rus. I'm from France I'm an I'm the architect on this project. Ah, I'm a building inspector. Pleased to meet you. Hi, Carol Nowaki, Santiago Cruz. What do you do, Santiago? I'm a crane operator. And you? Me? I'm a roofer. A roofer. Hi, my name is Camo Bocalit. Hi, Camo. I'm Santiago. Where are you from? From Caracas, Venezuela. Ah, Caracas. Sorry, Caracas, a beautiful city. I come from Morocco. Hello, my name is Camo Bocalit. Hi, Camo, I'm Carol Nowaki. And this is Isabella Rus. Hello, Isabella. Pleased to meet you. What do you do, Camo? I'm a plumber. I'm a roofer. And Isabella designs buildings. She's an architect. Yes, that's right. Okay, we will listen again. Unit 1. The construction industry. Recording 2. 1. Hi, I'm Jun Takahashi from the ministry. Hi, Mr. Takahashi. I'm Isabel Rue. I'm from France. I'm the architect on this project. Ah, I'm a building inspector. Pleased to meet you. Two. Hi, Karol Nowatsky. Santiago Cruz. What do you do, Santiago? I'm a grain operator. And you? Me? I'm a roofer. Three. Hi. My name is Kamal Bukhale. Hi, Kamal. I'm Santiago. Where are you from? From Caracas, Venezuela. Ah, Caracas. A beautiful city. I come from Morocco. Four. Hello. My name's Kamal Bukhale. Hi, Kamal. I'm Karol Novatsky. And this is Isabel Rue. Hello, Isabel. Pleased to meet you. What do you do, Kamal? I'm a plumber. I'm a roofer, and Isabel designs buildings. She's an architect. Yes, that's right. Okay, next. Did you do it right? I hope so. Read then three. Read this text and underline the verbs. Harun Rashid is 35 years old. So the verb is the verb is, is a verb to be. He comes from Alexandra. Comes is a verb. But lives in, lives and works in Cairo. Lives and works also verb. Haran is a general contractor. He hires. So is he, is he a verb? He hires subcontractors to work on building projects. Hire is a verb. He also organizes the material and equipment. Organizes here is a verb. Haran has a lot of experience in the construction industry. Has is a verb. 
Haran always works hard. Works. Sometimes he has meetings with clients. Has. Sometimes he visits construction sites. Visits. And sometimes he deals with suppliers. Deals. He is always busy. Is. But Friday is different. Is. Haran never works on Fridays. Friday is a day of. Okay. Next, number four. Correct these sentences. Haran Rashid is a plumber. plumber. Remember we the pronounced letter B, a plumber. So, he's a plumber. No, I don't think so. He is a general contractor, not plumber. He's a general constructor. So, this is phone. He's a general contractor. 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 Number two, he hires clients to work on building projects. No, he hires subcontractors to work on building projects. Hire subcontractor. Subcontractor. Next, number three, he has a lot of experience in tourist industry, no, in construction industry. Okay. Number four, he never visits construction sites. Let's see. Sometimes he visits construct construction sites. Sites. So here, not never, but sometimes. Number five, he always works on Fridays. He's always busy, but is Friday is different. Haran never works on Fridays. So not always, but never. Okay. Next, language. Present symbol B. We use B to say who somebody is or what something is. I'm Santiago Cruz. He's Haron Rashid. This is the construction site. We are roofers. We use B to ask personal questions. What's your name? My name is Carol. Present simple regular verbs. We use the present simple to talk about routines. We work in an office. Permanent situations and general truths. Water freezes at zero Celsius degree. We used adverbs of frequency and time expressions with the present simple. Harun Rashid never works on Fridays. 
He works every Saturday. Okay, next speaking number five. Work in pairs and introduce yourselves. Use this model to help you. A student A. Student A. And this is student B. Student A. Hi, hello, good morning. Student B. Hi, hello, good morning. Student A. I'm. Oh, my name's. Is symbol. I'm Jack. Uh, my name is Jack. And student B. Will answer. I'm. For example, Peter. Oh, my name's Peter. Next, please to meet your student. I said, Where are you from? Student B, I'm from, I'm from New York. And you, I'm from Vietnam. Vietnam. Okay. Next, finding out more, listening one. Listen and repeat the letters of the alphabet. Okay, we will listen and repeat. Unit one, recording three. A. A. H. H. J. J. K. K. B. B. C. C. D. D. E. E. G. G. P. P. T. T. V. V. Z. Z. F L L M M N N S S X X Z Z I I Y Y O O Q Q U U W W R R Okay Here Let the Z For British English But for American English They will pronounce Z Z Next number 2 Listen and write the surname you hear. Robot. What? Let's listen. Unit 1. Recording 4. 1. Hello, my name's Trochowski. That's T R O C First name, Robert. Thank you. Two, Carlos, Carlos del Bosque. How do you spell that? It's del Bosque. D.
the boss key. Three. Sasha Burgess. Pardon? Burgess. That's B. U. R. G. E. Double S. Okay. Robot. Jochowski, Carlos Deboski, Sasha Burgess. Okay, next speaking. Letter three. Sorry, number three. Working pairs. Student A look at information on this page. Student B look at information on page sixty-eight. Student A read the letters to student B. Write the letters. Student B says, what do the letters mean? <coughs> it's simple. It's simple H V A C. Mean heating, ventilation, and air conditioning. Next, R P M. Mean Revolutions per minute. Next, A C. On the nineteen current. Next, J C B. Mean, J C Bamford. Excavators limited. A construction equipment manufacturer. Okay, this is student A. Where is student B? Page sixty-eight. Where? How? 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 How can we move to city A? Okay. Here, the student B. The letter is P P E. P P E mean personal protection equipment. H V mean high voltage. Next, kg mean kilogram. P O L mean petro oil lubricants. Next, number four. Practice this conversation with your classmates. Write the names. What's your name? Jun Takahashi. How do you spell that? My first name is Jun, J U N. My family name is Takahashi, T A K A H A S H I. Thank you. Okay. Next. Listening five. Listen to three conversations. Write the jobs you hear for each person. Okay, we will listen. Unit one, recording five. One. Hello, I'm Ahmed. I'm the electrician from Chesterton's. Chesterton's, the subcontractors. Yes, that's right. Ah. Good to see you, Ahmed. I'm Tarek. Roofer. This is Yatsek. He's a roofer too. Hi, Yatsek. Hello, Ahmed. And that's Luis. What does he do? He's a crane operator. Okay. Two. Okay, everybody. New people. So please say your name and your job. Ahmed, electrician, from Chesterton's. Rob, laborer. Pierre, laborer. 
Luis, crane operator. Tarek, roofer. And I'm Kim, site manager. Three. Hello, my name is Antonio. Pardon? Antonio. Uh, hi, Antonio. I'm Ahmed. Are you the new electrician? No, I'm Antonio Rivaldi. Building inspector from the ministry. Ah, okay. Can I help you? I'm looking for Kim. Kim, the site manager. That's Kim over there. Thank you. Okay, so number one, Ahmed is electrician. And next, Tarit. Tarit, the subconstructors. No, Tarit is Ripfel. Tarit, Tarit Ripfel. And Jackson is Ripfel too. Louis is Grand Operator Next is number 5 Rob Rob is Labor Labor Laborer PA is Laborer too Laborer Laborer Kim Kim is Site Manager Eight Antonio Antonio is Building Inspector Inspector Next Language WH Questions WH Questions begin with a question word Example What, Where and How We use What when we want to know about something What's your name? What do you do? We use where to ask about places. Where do you walk? We use how to ask about the way to do something. How do you spell that? Question would be, we reverse the order of the verb be to form a question. He is on site today. Is he on site today? Next. Number six. Read the three conversations in other scripts 5 on page 72 and underline the questions in the conversations. So we are here, audio script 5. We will underline the question. Where is the question? Just on the subtractors, this is the question. We have question mark. So subcontractors, this is the question. That's right. Good to see you, Ahmed. Tarit. This is Jack said his trip for two. Okay. What does he do? This is the question. His grand operator. Pardon, pardon here is a question with a question mark. Are you the new electrician? Okay. Wow.
Okay. Enter the Revit Building Inspector. Can I help you here? I'm looking for Kim. Kim, the site manager. Okay. That's Kim over there. Next, seven. Oh, sorry. Seven. Complete these sentences with what, where, or how. Do you live? So, where do you live? Do you do? So, what do you do? Number three. Are you? So, how are you? Number four. Your address. So, what's your address? Number five. What time is it? Number six, how old are you? Number seven, is the site? Where is the site? Number eight, where are you from? Next, let the eight. Sorry, number eight. Put the words in one to six in the correct order to make questions. Then match the question to answers from A to F. What he do does so. The question is, what does he do? What does he do? Number two, can I help you? Can I help you? Number three, how do you spell that? How do you spell that number four where do you work remember question mark where do you work number six sorry number five what do you do? What do you do? Number six. Are you the site manager? Are you the site manager? Okay. Next, we match the question with the answer. He's a crane operator. So, what does he do? Number one. Let the B, I'm a plumber. So, where do you, where do you work? Or what do you do? Here we can match with number five. Number five also, what do you do? So number five, I'm a plumber. Let us see on a building site. So it's the answer for the question, where do you work? Number four. Next, C H E S T E. R T O N S. So this is spelling. So it's the answer for the question. How do you spell that? Number three. Next, I'm looking for Kim. I'm looking for Kim. Will answer for the question. Can I help you? Number two. The last one. F. Yes, I am. 
So the question is, are you the site manager? Number six. Okay. Next, speaking nine. Work in pairs. Take turns to ask and answer questions about the people in five. The people in five is here. Where? Here, Ahmed, Electrician, Tarek, Riffle, Jackson, Riffle, Louis, Grand Operator. So here we will ask, what does Kim do? She's a site manager. What about Tarek? Tarek is a, a roofer. Check here. Tarek is a roofer. He's a roofer. Okay, your turn. Your turn means now you ask the question. For example, what does Rob do? Rob is a laborer. And laborer here. What about Louis? Louis is a crane operator. Okay. Next. Okay, I think our lesson is finished here. I'm looking forward to seeing you next lesson. For the book, just visit my blog at Study English at home123.blogspot.com. You can download the free objects. You can also subscribe to my channel to get my updated videos. Thank you for watching.